How can I copy a DVD to another DVD using a single DVD drive? I need to copy a DVD to another DVD, but I have only a single DVD drive. How can I accomplish this? I tried copying files to the desktop and then to another DVD. It didn't work out. There are many ways to copy DVDs and many different programs out there to help with copying DVDs. Since you are using Windows 7 and Windows 7 comes with DVD burning software, I'll show you how to use the software that comes with Windows 7. The steps you took to copy the DVD should have worked. Once you copied all the files to the desktop, put in a blank DVD. If an autoplay box opens up with options, you can select burn files to disk using Windows Explorer. If the box does not show up after putting in the blank DVD, you can open up Windows Explorer and click on the DVD drive on the lower left side. You can leave the setting as with a CD slash DVD player if you want since it is compatible with older computers. Click next. Now drag and drop all the files from your desktop into the Explorer window. Then click burn to disk. Another window will open up, just click next. If you get any error messages, please update your question with the error message. If it's not a commercial movie DVD, you can use MGBurn to rip the DVD to an ISO and burn it back to a second disc. If it's a commercial movie DVD, I'm not sure this is the place to ask that if you get my drift. Burnaware free, downloadable from CNET, worked for me in two steps. Use the copy to image feature, creates the ISO. Use the burn image feature, select the created ISO to create new CD slash DVD. Work to treat no hassle. You might want to choose Advanced Setup instead of Express since it installed some Clean Your PC block which I simply uninstalled from Add Slash Remove Programs. Note this was for a bootable Windows 7 installed DVD and my system booted from the cloned disk fine into Windows Setup. All good burning software allowed to do on the fly copy. One reader plus one writer, or delayed copy, one reader writer. I usually use ISO Recorder which allow to create ISO files, then burn ISO files. If you want to support the channel, please consider subscribing.